Hi, welcome back to our Family Life channel. This is Sky. She's now seven months old. And as you can tell, I've got a treat in my hand which she really wants. Is that nice? Yummy. We've just been on a little shopping trip and the good thing is that Sky could come in with me because we went to Pets at Home. And we bought some treats and things for Sky today. So I'm just going to show you what we bought. Good girl, Sky. Uh, nose out, nose out. <laughs> this is our Pets at Home shopping bag. And as you can see, we've got some new treats. These are WAG training treats and they're absolutely brilliant. Um, she's sniffing a lot because all the other things are on in front of the camera. Come, come. Good girl, Sky. Good girl. Um, this flavour is chicken and cheese. <laughs> that obviously Sky really likes. It's the first time she's had this flavour. Um, we've had lots of the other ones before, but they're really good because they're a really good little size. They're actually perfect for when you're training them. Um, <laughs> so for me to get Sky to sit here with me, I have to give her treats. So when we're training and things like that, treats, 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 reward, 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 works brilliantly. Oh, they smell disgusting, but Sky seems to like them. Uh, next up, oh, what's this? Oh, what's this? <laughs> These are Schmackos, and they are from Pedigree. Um, and they, these are actually a multi pack. So they've got um, four lip smacking flavours inside. So there's actually 20 and they're like little strips as you can see there, which they really, really, Sky really, really likes these. Um, and it's really good because they've got a resealable label there. So when you take one out, you can fold it over and stick it over so that it keeps them fresh. Do you like the look of them? They look very nice, don't they? Pedigree. Schmackos. She's going to give her another treat because she's been really good. Ah, oh, yeah. Good girl. Good girl. So these are more like chew stick type things. They are from uh, Misfits and they are Wonky Chomp, are these ones. And they are with lip smacking liver. Oh. Do they sound nice? They actually look quite big. I can feel them on the inside and they have, I'll tell you what, let's just open them and then we can have a look and see what, see what they are. <gasps> Shall we open them? You've been very good girl. What a good girl. Ooh, does that smell nice? Now there's two in here, in this pack, um, and they're actually quite substantial. Oh, is that nice? Mm, 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 mm. So that's what it looks like, and it's got this bit in the middle there. Put that back in while she's not looking. Because she hasn't had her tea yet. So look, she's now gone to try and go around the table to get them. Come back up here. She says, I don't want the little treats anymore because you've shown me a big whopper dopper one. Come on. Come, come, come. Good girl. Right. So, we've also got uh, a jumbo, and there's two in here, and <laughs> she's not going to stay because she can smell stuff. Now that I've opened it, she can smell it. Um, okay, so this one is again from Pedigree, and it's a jumbo, and these are two medium size. They come in different sizes, so they come in smaller ones, and then this is a medium, and then they do one big one, which is pretty big and actually keeps them keeps them occupied for quite a while. Uh, this one is with chicken and rice, which I know she likes because she's had one of the big ones. So that's what that looks like. Is that nice? <gasps> is that nice? Mmm. Oh, she's sitting down. And like the other ones, um, these are jumbo ones as well, um, but these are minis. So you can see the difference. That's the size 
and about that wide you can see them that's them these are the mini ones and these come with beef and there's four in this pack here so as you can tell that's the mini ones and these are the medium ones that size and then you get the one large one on its own so what we also have bought for Sky, um, we've already got one of these, but we got one when she was a puppy. Um, so now that she's got a bit bigger, we've gone for a bigger size. This is called a Kong. Now these are really, really popular. Um, you can get them from really tiny little ones to ones that are bigger than this one. She's pawing me, look, she's pawing, got a paw on me because she wants some food. She's feeling a treat. Um, so yeah, this is the Kong and what we did with the other one, you could put treats in there, um, we actually put peanut butter in there, uh, kept her occupied for ages because they tend to, you know, when they get bored they get mischievous so that's when things get chewed and, you know, holes get dug and things like that so she really actually enjoys this. This is the extra large one. Dogs that are 60 to 90 pounds, 27 to 41 kg. Well, we've had her weighed today and she is <laughs> 21.6. So she last time she was weighed, she was 9.8 kilos. So she's grown quite a lot. That's the Kong Classic. And you can see there, you can actually put, you can buy treats to put in or you can put any kind of treats in. One thing I did see actually, I saw it on YouTube um, and what he did was he put, um, if you've got their own dried food, so it's kind of like small pellet type dried food, um, what, he, what this guy did was put a tiny bit of water in and then put the food into here and put it in the freezer. So it all, when it had frozen, took it out so it takes them just that bit longer to get the stuff out um, but yeah it's, it's really rewarding for them um, and Sky really enjoys the other one. The next thing we got was this, um, now because she's a husky naturally she wants to pull every time she's running um, but she like my 14 year old daughter tries to take her for a walk and she nearly pulls her arm out of a socket she's really 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 strong obviously um, so we've tried different kinds of things we tried a harness which ties at the back um, that was just a, a, more of an instinct for her to pull we tried one with just a normal collar but she was she was pulling so much that she was making herself like a you know of the way she was breathing so obviously that wasn't right um, so I went into Pets at Home yes <laughs> yes just a minute you've got to come up here though these lovely people want to see you come on up. good girl right come sit sit good girl so when we went into Pets at Home um, I spoke to the people that work there because I'd read about the Holti uh, harness which is basically um, a harness that kind of goes over the front of their nose there um, and it's kind of to stop them from pulling. Uh, so I looked at that first and then whilst I were there the, the lady at the counter said to me have you seen the pets at home anti-pull harnesses so I was like no you know anything I'd like to try anything to be honest. Um, so. This is called a stop pull harness um, and it says it's instant results, quick and easy to use and it's padded for extra comfort because I was really worried about anything that you know kind of pulls them or you know I don't want anything that hurts her or you know things like that. Um, so I'd read about the harnesses where the, the lead goes on the front so when they pull all they do is pull themselves around to face you um, but this one uh, we got the large because obviously she's getting quite big now so that's it um, and as you can see it kind of just goes it goes over her head and then you pop their legs in the front and all it is is it's really simple but it does go over the front and then into the back but there's like a drawstring uh, there's a bit of a drawstring thing um, that actually stops it from going any further and we tried it on in the shop obviously for size so I said look leave it on and we then went for a walk and I'm telling you now, it was like walking a different dog. It was unbelievable. I was really shocked at how quick it actually worked. Um, and it, where it actually ended up being a joy to walk her because I've got quite a bad back. So 
I've been quite reluctant to walk her. My daughter does most of her walking um, with her and I was just, I was absolutely amazed. <laughs> She's currently biting my nail. <laughs> Are you biting my nail? I've got another one, you've got schlubber all over me, haven't you? heard something outside. It's okay. I think that's probably Amber coming home because she knows that she's going for a walk soon. Mwah. Mwah. Beautiful girl. <laughs> he says, Mummy, just give me that. So that harness, that stop pull harness was absolutely brilliant. It's been a massive really big game changer for us as that um, so we can't wait to go out on more walks I've got one last thing to show you here I can't believe I'm actually touching this and it makes me go a bit Poof. good girl good girl so what I have got is this and it's a pig's ear Can't really say anything else about that. It stinks. I think she quite likes it. Ooh. You're licking it. She's off now. Blech. I think we need to take it off the sofa, don't you? Because it's. Hmm? Yeah. I don't think we want it on the sofa, do you? I don't want a stinky pig's ear on the sofa. Thanks. Come on, you slumbering. Go on, let's take it outside. <laughs> she won't let go. <laughs> she won't let go of it. Come on. Come on then. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Right. Go on. Good girl. She's chomping on that now. Ooh, I can hear it crunching. Oh, it's horrible. Um, so, all in all, because um, we are in the Pets at Home VIP club, obviously zapped our card, I spent £43.24 today. The harness cost £19, um, the Kong, that cost £12, so those are the two most expensive things. Uh, that I bought everything else pretty much all the treats and things they're usually on offer um, so yeah so I got quite a few of them just because they were on offer today if you've got a pet let me know in the comments below what their favorite treat is thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you soon